Bright orange flames engulf a mound of scrap and discarded vehicles. The intense fire sending thick black plumes of smoke into the air over West Sacramento. Approximately 80 to 100 wrecked vehicles, stacked 10 vehicles tall, heavily involved in fire. West Sacramento Fire got the initial call around 3.30 that one car in the yard was on fire. But that quickly grew and both the Sacramento and Yolo Fire Departments arrived to assist. Some of the most impressive help came from the tow yard's forklift driver, playing an integral part in helping firefighters put out the flames. He moves a number of cars and trucks away from the pileup so firefighters could get to the heart of the stack. Here he is carrying three cars out of the lot at once while the flames are still raging. Keep in mind, he's trained on the forklift and not as a firefighter. As he's picking it apart, we're able to get closer into the seat of the fire. It's a very deep seated fire in this stack. That's a very large stack of, of wrecked vehicles. Um, and with his assistance, we're able to make a, you know, a fire attack and, and continue our extinguishment efforts. We don't know what sparked the flames, but fire officials say leftover gasoline still inside the gas tanks likely helped fuel the flames. But once this metal gets burning, it burns extremely hot and it's very difficult to extinguish. The fire continued to burn for several hours. As night fell, these shots from the ground show firefighters on the tops of container trucks parked in the lot a good vantage point to spray water into the pileup of cars. Outside the front entrance of the tow yard, about a dozen charred vehicles laying in the street, some still smoldering. After three and a half hours, the fire was contained and under control. In West Sacramento, Walter McCullough, KCRA 3 News.